Matthew 16, 1 through 4. Trusting in the signs instead of seeking a sign. Oh my God, that's good. And when you have it, say amen. Amen. And then the Pharisees and the Sadducees came testing him. Asked that he would show them a sign from heaven. And he answered and said to them, when it is evening, you say, it will be fair weather. For the sky is red, and in the morning, it will be foul weather today. For the sky is red and threatening. You hypocrites, you know how to discern the face of the sky, but you cannot discern the signs of the time. A wicked and adulterous generation seeks after signs, and no sign shall be given to it except the sign of the prophet Jonah. Mm. And he left them and departed. Trusting in the signs instead of seeking a sign. Beloved, God is wanting us to discern our times mm. right now that we're in. When he was talking about Jonah, he was talking about how, how Jonah was given a, a sign, but he chose to go in the belly of the well for three nights and three days Jesus. before he was threw Jesus. up in the place where he was supposed to be. Mm -hmm. My God. See, Jonah was trying to look for a sign, but he had already seen the signs. God wants us to, 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 to understand his word and, and get into his word and, and, and allow that word from the Old Testament all the way up to the New Testament to, to, to search our hearts, to open up our eyes so we can see the signs that he said was going to happen back then, right now in our daily lives Amen. in 2016. Jesus. Beloved, see, he wants us to trust in the signs and not looking for a sign. You see, a lot of times, us as Christians, we say that we love you, Lord. We say that we want to be a part of you, Lord. We say all of that just to say I'm looking for a sign from you, Heavenly Father. Not looking at the signs that you've already done. Not understanding the prophecy that you talked about and you preached about it. Every man that had paid the way for the Christ talked about for us to see right now. Are you living in the last days? Are you certain that we're living in the last days? Have you checked the records? Jesus. To show if we're living in the last days, or is it something that you hear someone else say? <laughs> wow. Look at the signs wow. and stop looking for a sign. Are you just look, are you just hearing Jesus. stuff? You said I, I you said I, 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 I want the, the love of God, but do you know what the love of God is? Do you know that the love of God is, is that he put his name in your hands? The love of God is the one that he got hit with the cocktails and, and all the skin was off his back. That's the love of God. But do you see the signs? Are you just looking for a blessing? Just bless me, Lord. Just fill mm -hmm. my pockets, Lord. Just, just give me a building, Lord. Wow. Just give me wow. this, Lord. Just give me a new car, Lord. Just give me a house, Lord. My goodness. That's a sign. You just want to see a sign. I'm not going to serve you, Lord, till you show me that you're real. <laughs> I'm not going to listen to you until you do what you did for, for Gideon. He said, I've been showing you the signs day in and day out. I've been showing you the signs. But have you been looking? Have you been seeing it? Have you been seeing the sign that I've been showing you? Bigger than what we can see. We come into church and the church is empty, but it's bigger than what our eyes can see. It's bigger than my feelings are right now. It's bigger. Come on. Come on. It's bigger, beloved. We got to know that. We got to. We're, it, it's, it's so bigger that we're living in the times of, 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 of when the church is at, at its worst. Mm -hmm. wow. We're living in a time where people yes. ain't coming to church. They, oh, and we, we're living in a time when oh, there ain't nothing but antichrist going on. We're oh, living Pastor. in a time where oh, people are starting to worship the moon, the stars, and the skies. Come on, Pastor. Come on. That's the time that we're living in. I preach that. Mm -hmm. But you're still looking for a sign. Instead of looking at the signs that God is showing us. Let's see, this is what we find. Look at 2 Corinthians 3, 14 through 15. It says, but the people's mind was hardened. Mm. And to say this day, whenever the old covenant is being read, the same veil covers their minds so they cannot understand the truth. On, and man. this veil mm -hmm. can be removed only by believing in Christ Jesus mm -hmm. fully. 
And yes, even today when the Moses writing or read, their hearts are covered with the same veil and they do not understand. The problem is that we've been hurt so many times that, on, that, that every time that, that, that God pulls the veil off our hearts, we just put it back on. Jesus. It's just like being in a, it's, it's like Adam and Eve and there was a neck in it and there was neck and it wasn't ashamed. We shouldn't be ashamed that God is with us. Come but on. we still want to come cover on. up the come truth. On. Look at the signs of the times. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's all he was trying to show them. Look, you're a hypocrite. You don't understand what's going on right now. So you're all, all out for fame and fortune and money and all this other stuff when all I want you to do is do my will. Mm -hmm. Can you do my will without a title? Come Can you do now, my Lord. will without no money? On, Can now, you I'm do my stuff. will Come on. without the best looking car? Can you do my will in the basement of a house? Can you do my will and tend my sheep? Can you do that for me? Jesus. Look at the, the signs that he's given us, beloved. Look at the signs that he's given us. My God. We can't be too prestigious and think that 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 that's how God blesses. No. We understand that it's going to take some work. <coughs> Even know that we got uh, we got we we got work to do. We do. We got work to do. The blessings, look at the signs. The blessings never came without work. Joseph never was blessed to be the top dog in charge if he didn't go through some situation. Jonah was blessed even when he didn't want to do it because he went through the process. Mm -hmm. David was blessed even though that he was the king, but, but he, he said, don't touch my anointing even when the Come king was offline. He still Come blessed on. the king. Amen. Look at the signs. He says, look at the signs and know that we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against dark regions and situations over that, over that place. Mm. See, we're not battling a person across from us and next to us. We're battling, uh, we battling that, 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 that hovering spirit, that seducing spirit, those, 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 those conniving spirits mm. that's been latched on. Jesus. As they walk through their process. Jesus. But I know Jesus. Yes, you God. See, yes, God. When you know yeah. Jesus, you understand God. that you got to fight with Let's the name of him. Jesus. You got to proclaim the sign of Jesus over that situation. Allow yes, that demon God. to flee. You see, it might cost us something for that demon to flee, but I understand that the anointing that we're gonna get from making that that demon flee is worth worth more than gold. Look at the sign. When they went over to deliver the man that had the legions in him, it cost them something. Look at the signs. It cost them so much that they put him out of the city. So they, they may put us out of the city for trusting in the sign of God. But know that there's a city in heaven waiting Come on us when we now. get there for Amen. doing the things that God Amen. has called us to do. Amen. Amen. Trust in his sign. There's a mission that he placed us on. Every born again believer knows the mission. We know the mission, but are we adhering mm. to the signs that he's mm. shown? We talk about the mission, we study about the mission, mm. but can we say, have we applied the mission? Mm. We've got to ask ourselves, Lord, are we applying the mission that you told us to apply? Because you've given us the signs now. Sometimes we have to look at us. And look at, don't look at nobody else. We've got to look at us to say, okay, Lord, yeah. how am I supposed to get from A to B? Yeah. How am I supposed to do that, Lord? How am I supposed to get there, Heavenly Father? He's saying, look at the signs. Come on. Look at the cloud of witnesses that went before you and and have and, and, and testified to my goodness. Mm. Another thing that God just downloaded into me right now, he said, even back then, they didn't 
want me as much as they didn't want me now. 